When it comes to UX strategy, no one can predict the future. But you can take some time to reflect on external contextual factors that may impact your user and your work in the future. If you need an easy to remember prompt to start thinking about strategy and big picture trends, remember this metaphor. If you want to see far ahead, find a high vantage point, like a steeple. Steeple stands for social, technological, economic, environmental, political, legal, and ethical. Social factors include culture, overall social sentiment, and attitudes that may impact acceptance of an offering. This often varies from user segment to user segment, so it can be helpful to examine social factors from multiple perspectives, including employee perspectives. Technological factors relate to how far along a technology has innovated and evolved, what technical skills your audience has, and how much technical infrastructure is already in place for your offering to be adopted. Economic factors relate to more than just disposable income or budgets that your audience has but also how the economic climate might change in the coming months or years. While the economic future is always uncertain, even in good times, acknowledging economic disparities or economic opportunity can also lead to ideas for ways to reach new markets. Environmental factors relate to changes in physical environments like climate, physical terrain, accessibility to physical resources, physical movement and transportation, and how those might all impact access to your offering. Political and legal factors aren't just about bipartisan debates, but also relate to business partnerships or impending public policy changes that may soon change the way that the business can operate. For example, certain value-added tax laws or compliance requirements may lead to increased costs and other challenges with operating procedures. So political factors relate to potential changes in policy, while legal factors relate to existing laws or regulations that currently impact the way that the business operates. Finally, ethical factors relate to ways in which our organization may be inadvertently perpetuating or causing harm, or how we can protect our customers from potential harm, or how our organization can stay aligned to its own values and the values of its customers. A steeple analysis is often best done in a group because having multiple perspectives can help you fill in the gaps of knowledge while also identifying which gaps are the most critical to resolve. However, they shouldn't be done with assumptions alone. Desk research can also help you fill in some of those gaps. You can look at annual industry reports or global threat predictions, like those from the World Economic Forum Risk Report, the Edelman Trust Barometer, and other relevant industry reporting to anticipate potential risks, identify overall trends, and anticipate future challenges before they happen. That said, what ifing everything to death is also counterproductive. So it might be beneficial to narrow down to events or concerns that have high or increasing probability of happening as each year progresses. Needless to say, these analyses are not one and done sessions that last forever. Rather, they're better suited to being living documents or evolving repositories that the team revisits as relevant current events warrant. For example, there are some years that are volatile, full of change, just like the past few years of the pandemic. However, there are also some years where little change occurs and the previous assessment remains largely unchanged. Still, it's better not to assume that all change is slow and to get relevant, timely information to ensure that these analyses are accurate and useful. Doing this on a semi-annual or annual basis will help keep your team prepared and proactive rather than panicked and reactive. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more of our UX videos, take a look at these over here and consider subscribing to our channel. On our website, nngroup.com, you can access our free library of over 2,000 articles. You can also register for one of our UX courses that offer live, hands-on, UX training.